Hello and welcome. I'm Peter Ratcliffe and I'm so excited today to be sharing my passion with you on meditation in this masterclass. Just for being here, I want to give you a free ebook which you can take away and which will take you through step by step how to get into a deeper state of meditation. And in this masterclass, I want to give you some of the key secrets that have enabled me to go from years of meditating in a so-so manner to actually get into finally those deeper states of meditation where you experience bliss and a sense of oneness with everything. But I want to do that so you can go and share that with communities around you because meditation needs to be taught more in the world today so we can have a better world. So I want you to do that and I want you to have a successful class and so as well as teaching you about meditation, I want you to show you how you can set up your own class in as little as 21 days and most importantly, how you can start with a cash flow of a thousand dollars up front before you even start your first class. So if you're as excited as me to get in, then let's jump over to the slides and we'll start taking you through this incredible knowledge that I've been able to gather together over the past 30 or 40 years. All right, so welcome. Here we are at the slides, the Skillful Mind Masterclass, which is a done for you guide to build a fulfilling business that works for your lifestyle. Now, as I said, we're going to give you a free gift full of really the pith instructions that I use to reach a more deeper state of meditation, which I hope you can use and, and give to other people. We're going to show you how to download that book at the end. It is a book full of material that you can use even if you've never meditated before to learn the, the key parts to a deeper meditation. And we'll go through some of this stuff later in the presentation. Now, what we are going to cover in this masterclass today is firstly the secret that I learned really over a period of about 20 years uh, from different meditation teachers. The key that I use to take my meditation to a deeper and more blissful meditation. And I want to share that with you so that you can go and share it with people in your community. I also want to show you how to set up your own meditation class in 21 days or less. I want to take you step by step to show you how to do that. And lastly, I want to show you also how you can earn a thousand dollars even before you launch your first meditation class. So you can really go into this cash flow positive so you don't have any worries about covering your costs or anything like that. So are you ready to go? Are you excited? Because I can tell you that right now in the world there is no better time than to start meditation and to start teaching meditation. And the reason for this is an, a number of different reasons. First of all, you know, we're going through a reset in this crisis. People have been working their butt off for years. They're suddenly at home alone with time to spend, but people are starting to look at what's important in their life rather than just staying on this never ending hamster wheel, going from paycheck to paycheck. To paycheck. They're sort of looking forward to when this crisis is over and it will end. You know, what do we want to do next? So, and the reason why this is people are stuck at home, they're feeling in stressed and they're in and they're looking towards meditation. In fact, our online meditation classes are booming. We've got more people than ever because people are looking towards meditation. And of course, their only access is to do it online. So if you're stuck at home also, this is the perfect time for you because our excuse that we normally have in daily life is, I'd really love to learn meditation, but I'm too busy. I've got work to go to and that. But now we have more time, or most of us, than anything else. And so why not use that time wisely to create something useful, both now, so you can deal with the stress, and in the future when you're ready to start your own class. Classes have been growing for a long time now. In fact, by market research here, you can see here there's 2,450 meditation studios in the US alone. And on average, they're grossing over $269,000 each. So there's a huge market and it is growing in popularity. In fact, the research done by the Global Wellness Summit 
predicts that the market is about to double in the next few years from about 1.2 billion a couple of years ago in 2017 up to 2 billion by 2022. And for that reason, we need meditation leaders, but not only just meditation leaders, we need good ones with sound understanding of what meditation is, how it works, why it works, and how to do it. And that is why we need you. And that is why if you take up that challenge, you can change into a much more fulfilling life. Just like Lauren, who wakes up passionate about meditation every day. She is the type of person we're looking at. So who is this presentation not for? First of all, it's not for people who only want to teach for materialistic gain. Now, we don't have anything against abundance, but we want people with passion, whose first and foremost passion is to share meditation. If you have the passion, the abundance will come. Now, having said that, this is also not for people who think meditation should be taught for free. We do have, I must say, many of our leaders are teaching for free and they have the resources to do that. But really, this is a class to show you how to set up your own meditation practice and be self-sustaining. It's also not for people who think you have to be an expert, like companies who say you have to train for years before you can start your own class. We believe that you should learn together with your class. And so we show you how to start a class step by step within just a couple of weeks, and then you can go on to learn more. It's also finally not for people who aren't open to meditations from different traditions and cultures. We have meditations from around the world, and indeed I have gained pearls of wisdom from the most unlikely of places. So now let's look at who it is for. Now, this workshop is first and foremost for people who want to start running a successful meditation group but have no idea where to start, or perhaps they've tried and they've run a few community small meditation groups, and want to expand that into a professional type of class. Next, it's for people who want to do that in a community. You know, I have a saying, in a high tide, all ships rise. And at Skillful Mind, we help each other to have successful meditation classes and to get better at what we're doing. So we are like-minded individuals. And finally, it's for people who want to share their gift with the world and have benefited greatly, either from a mental point of view or even a physical point of view through doing meditation. And we have that passion to share with others. So that's why I created the Skillful Mind Academy. Now let's have a look at that because basically in our Skillful Mind family, if you like, we've got three types of leaders. The first one who is passionate about meditation, who wants to deepen their own meditation and they want to share that gift with those in their communities. Just like Bronwyn here, who wrote to me the other day, telling me that one of her gentle smilers came up and gave her a long hug saying, I love you, and said that all her problems dissolve in just the 40 minute sessions that they have together in their meditation class. The second type of leader we have, often people who are already in the uh, health and wellness industry, and they want to add on meditation to their business to both offer that to their existing customers to work in conjunction with whatever they do, but also to attract a larger customer base because meditation lessons are an actual great way for the community to, to come together and to attract new people that you can get to know who might then go on to do other areas of that person's particular business. So for example, Bettina working in Perth runs a yoga studio and yoga classes and she wanted to add on meditation classes to her yoga class and used the resources to make it easy for her to set up that meditation class and she's really going from strength to strength. The third type of leader is those who maybe have been in the same job for many years and want to move from something that they have to do to something that they love and wake up in the morning and passionate about doing. Many of our leaders have made that change from a job into a passion. Just like Matthew here, who was in the health industry and wanted to move out of that and teach meditation. In an interesting twist, Matthew used a lot of the sales materials that we've got to go actually back into the hospitals where he was familiar with, and now he helps patients meditate to promote their healing, which we know meditation is great at assisting uh, people to heal. 
So that's a little bit about our leaders, but what about me? Who is this Peter Radcliffe? That I wanted to just share with you how I came to have the passion to put this leader program together. You see, I started off studying engineering at university. In fact, I was already very interested quite early on in meditation. And when I became an engineer, I had the fortune of working throughout Asia, different countries in Asia and the Middle East. So I had the benefit of studying many different traditions like Hinduism and Buddhism and Sufism and Jainism and all the isms. I also was interested in different psychologies like uh, NLP and things like that. But probably more than anything, I was attracted to Buddhism and meditation. And in Thailand, I actually decided to ordain myself and went and lived in a monastery in the middle of a jungle to meditate sometimes up to 10 hours a day. It was an amazing experience in my life and I learned a lot. But I'm going to share something with you. I studied for many years and I, sure, I got some experience and I got better at meditation, but I never achieved those levels which I really wanted to. And it wasn't until many years later when I met root guru of mine, Lama Chodak Rinpoche, who is a Tibetan teacher living in Australia, in Canberra, about a thousand kilometers away from me, that I really had my epiphany of what I was doing wrong. It's an interesting story, actually, because I arranged for someone to pick me up at the Canberra airport, and they were there with this small Asian man, etc. And of course, lo and behold, I was thrilled to see it was actually Lama Chodak himself come to sort of pick me up at the airport. And we ended up having 45 minutes in the car together where I literally had him next to me and I could pick his brain and I had so many questions. I guess the main was embarrassingly I admitted to him that I'd been studying meditation for well over 15 years by that stage and I'd never gotten to the meditation states that, that I'd read about and that I wanted to achieve. And he quite sort of nonchalantly turned to me and said, look, Pete, you're never going to do it without the, the proper technique. And that was a bit of a watershed. It was a bit of a slap in the face, to be honest with you, but it was also a watershed moment. Through that retreat, we sort of went through the steps to get into a deep meditation, doing the practices that he taught me. And indeed, I achieved a state of meditation, which, you know, just for me, blew my world apart. Like it was so amazing and so deep. And from that day onwards, I was passionate about teaching as many people about how to do meditation properly and how to go beyond just the beginner stage and into those deeper stages of meditation. And I'm still passionate about it. And in the last few years, I've developed my vision, and that is to see a meditation group in every town and suburb around the world. And I believe that this is important for the world itself. And my mission is to give people everything they need to, to be successful in doing what they love. So that's why the Skillful Mind Academy, we made a done-for-you system that makes it quick and easy to set up your own meditation business. Now, we've been growing quite quickly over the last couple of years, and we're up to over 300 leaders around the world sharing what they love. But we need more, just like Deborah here, who came into our program we gave her all the videos and worksheets and audio so that she was able to start her own class uh, over in the UK now, I think up in Scotland she is. So that was Australia and Scotland, but we've also got leaders in the US. And it's not only me who wants to see new leaders, there is a demand for it. I want to show you some statistics from a study that was done by the US government, actually the US Department of Health and Human Services to be exact, and shown that meditation used by adults has grown in a five year period from 4% to 14%. I mean, that is massive growth and it's an exponential curve. And if you think that statistic is amazing, have a look at this. Meditation use by children has grown by tenfold. And remember, these children of today are going to be the adult meditation of tomorrow. So this is very encouraging. Now, I want to talk about a little disclaimer because I have given you a brief overview of many of the uh, leaders that we have who have done amazing things. Not everybody has achieved these results, but there is one thing that makes a distinction between those people who have got successful classes, and that is they take action. Now, as I promised, I want to really dive into what I'm passionate about, which is the proper technique 
for taking ourselves to a deeper and more blissful meditation so that you know and you can share that with the community around you. And I want to introduce you to a little depiction called the nine stages of meditation. This is one of the core teachings which again had a profound impact on me because it shows that meditation is not some sort of magical thing, it's a step-by-step -step approach leading you gradually deeper and deeper into deeper stages of meditation. Now this is a depiction that you'll actually find on Tibetan monasteries which shows the stages of the nine meditation. It starts at the bottom where you can see the monk trying to control his elephant and the elephant represents the mind in the Tibetan Buddhist tradition because the mind is powerful like an elephant so it can both be a help if it's controlled properly but also it can wreck a lot of damage if the mind is out of control. It's also being led astray by something that I think many of us have heard of called the monkey mind which represents the restlessness of the mind and this depiction as I say starts off at the bottom where the monk is out of control of his mind and gradually learns to tame the elephant or tame his mind until finally right up the top uh, you can see on the left hand side the meditator is sitting down quietly with his elephant and then of course there's some rainbows at the top you know enlightenment and nirvana uh, which I'll go through uh, uh, sometime in the course but the important thing is to take us back to the bottom where we are on the beginning of this path. Now one thing, a distinction which I want to make even before we get on the path is the understanding between the thinking mind, which we normally consider the mind, and our awareness. Now it's sometimes difficult to understand this distinction but it's vital in order for you to really gain that insight to start progressing your meditation. You see the thinking mind is the one that gets us into all the trouble. It's the one that causes the distraction. It's the ones that makes us feel like we want this and we don't want this and we want this person to go and this person to come into our life. Whereas their awareness only operates in the present moment and is the foundation of this magical thing called mindfulness which is so prevalent in psychology these days. To be mindful means to be in the present moment which means that you're aware of what's going on around you and in particular as well as being aware of sights, sounds, smells, tastes, feelings etc. There's one type of awareness which is even more important and that is awareness of our thoughts and it is this act the meditator sitting down to meditate which builds up the ongoing constant in the time awareness of his or her own thoughts and gradually through that process he begins to first of all see the and then understand the mind and through that tame the elephant. Now the understanding of the mind is represented by the changing color of the elephant from black to white. So black means the uh, nature of mind is obscure, they, do, they literally don't know what their mind does and then gradually as we learn, oh, so that's why I get frustrated, oh, so that's why I get angry, oh, so that's why I get anxious, we learn what and why the mind does what it does and consequently we learn to tame it, to be able to bring the mind to pacification. So let's go through some of these stages just for fun, hey? Stage one, the meditator, as you can see, is totally out of control of his mind and the mind is instead being led by something that we might have heard called the monkey mind, which is our restlessness of the mind. So we have to really tame this monkey and both of them are black. As we go from the bottom, the second path has the elephant slowing down a little bit. He's slowed down to a walk and likewise the monkey has slowed down and there's a patch of white on the head of both the monkey and the elephant, meaning that the meditator is starting to understand his or her own mind. There are some other symbols here, there's the flame which represents the amount of effort that you need to put into your meditation, which is a lot at first, but gradually as you get more proficient at meditation it becomes more natural and you do it more automatically. There's also what the meditator is holding, which is a rope which stands for mindfulness and a hook 
which stands for awareness or also knowing or uh, understanding of the mind. So he has these two hooks, mindfulness, keeping the elephant in place, and the hook, the awareness to try to discover and understand the mind. Now, in stage three, you can see that he eventually gets the rope around the neck of the elephant, and the elephant gradually looks back at him. Now, in this stage, we actually consider that if a person can stay on the meditation object for 50% of the time, or greater than 50% of the time, they've achieved a state of mindfulness, where you can basically, you're learning to hold the mind in place for extended periods of time. Before that, you might sit in meditation for half an hour or an hour, but you spend the majority of that thinking about what you're going to have for lunch or what your mother-in-law said the other day or what you're going to do at work tomorrow. At stage three, we're able to sit, there's still 50% of the time or less, thinking about other uh, subject matter, but at least we've got awareness for 50% of the time. Now, there are different critters. You'll see a rabbit, which signifies subtle dullness, which means that as we get comfortable with our meditation practice, one of the obstacles that comes up is sleepiness and dullness, where we sink into a sort of semi-comatose state, where we're still aware and it feels good, but it is an obstacle to meditation. Contrary to what some meditation teachers say, meditation is not this kind of half zombie-like semi-sleep state, when you achieve a really deep state of meditation, you are really aware. Like you're aware of, you know, a fly crawling on the wall 10 meters away. You're aware of every nuance of um, feeling going through your body. It's a very uplifted and a very in control state. Not at all the sleepy state that some meditation teachers pretend that meditation is. So we need to get over this dullness as we progress through the meditation stages. Level four shows a deepening of that stage. And by the end of level four, we can stay on the meditation object for the entire meditation session. And when we're able to achieve that, it means that we are in control of our mind. It means that what we decide to think about, our mind will stay on that thought rather than getting distracted and thinking about other things, which leads us to stage four where they turn a corner again and you can see a big change here in that the meditator is now stepping in front of the elephant and using his awareness to, I guess, gradually stroke the nose of the elephant to calm it and find out more about the mind, etc. The other stages are quite advanced stages of meditation where the meditator in stage six is starting to look out into the world for things that might agitate him or her because it is still the world which is the, I guess, mirror of our mind. So if we can meditate sitting down by ourselves and be calm, that's one thing. But if we're being in the middle of a fight between a, a corporate takeover or whatever, then that is obviously going to cause stress. And it is at that time where we, we really start to see you know, tendencies of our mind to get stressed. It's, it's those testing conditions. So that's where the meditator in stage six is, is looking out into the world to see what else he needs to learn to uh, further develop his or her own mind. Now, again, I'll run through the, the, the higher stages. Seven, he's let go of the rope completely because uh, the elephant is now so much in control, it pretty much does exactly as the meditator asks the mind to do. The poor monkey is having to say goodbye because at this stage there is next to no restlessness in the mind. It's just a matter of understanding the final stages, the last parts of the mind at this stage uh, to bring the, the mind totally to rest. At stage eight, the meditator un understands his or her own mind completely until at stage nine, it's like ripples finally subduing in a pond and the pond becomes completely still and then the elephant actually sits down and rests by the side of the meditator, and that is what we call one-pointed meditation. And at this point, you can concentrate on your breath. You, with a small amount of effort, you can be aware of your breath and go into the deepest states of meditation that are possible for hours at a time. So this diagram is a beautiful little 
pictorial diagram of the various stages, but has enormous amounts of information into it. And in fact, there is more information that I can uh, talk to you about, which I do in our, of course, our full meditation course. And we also give you the techniques to go from one stage to the other. So now we've covered the nine stages of meditation. And of course, this is really just part of the teaching, which in total is around eight or nine hours to take you step by step so you learn fully how to get into those deeper states of meditation. And I want to show you how you can access the all the total complete part of the teaching so that you know you can be like uh, Rowena who went through the course and said like me that you know she'd been meditating for years and it wasn't until she learned the proper technique that she was able to take her practice to a higher level. Let's talk about what's in the program. As I said we have different parts the first part of which is the certification and teaching course. So this is where the bulk of all our videos are. It takes you in a unique step-by-step -step framework through beginner, through intermediate, and through advanced teachings so you gradually learn how to deepen your meditation practice. There's over a hundred videos and audios and different resources, guided meditations in this first learning and certification part of our program. It teaches you in depth what I started teaching you earlier, which is the holistic nine step blissful meditation sequence. It also teaches you more advanced teachings, but it also goes through in a separate module about how to actually set up your class, what you need to know, what venue you should look for, the insurance, what you need to do when they first step into the classroom, whether you need to do a yoga stretch. And finally, we finish this section with an assessment which gives you a world-recognized accredited med meditation certification, recognized by bodies around the world. This allows you to then start your own classes with the backing of us and with the backing of various organizations to give you the credibility that you need to attract those customers into your class. Now, once you've done that, you can set yourself up, just like Emma here, her meditation classes are thriving and what she likes is that the support just keeps on coming. So we are continuously adding more modules onto that training that then automatically pop up in your members area so you can keep learning to a greater depth as we build more and more onto this program. The Skillful Mind program we do sell, it's $970 and it's perfect for those people who want to really roll with their passion and get up and running as quickly as possible in 21 days or less with a small community group. And that is the first part of our program. You can see that you can do, uh, buy these individually. Of course, we can also sell them as a bundle, which I'll get to later. Now, the second part, which is ideal for people who are in the health and wellness and they want access to done for you lesson plans is what we call the resource vault. Now in here, we literally have a lesson plan for you for every single week of the year. In fact, we have more than that. We're building out a second year as we speak. So 52 done for you lesson plans. We not only have that though, we have other courses. We have a eight week calm schools program for people who wanna teach children, perhaps five to 12 year olds. We also have a 10 week peaceful weight loss program for those that wanna use meditation for health. And in particular, a big field nowadays is for weight loss and for people who understand that mindset is important to losing weight and stress and anxiety are big factors in people who can't lose weight. Uh, been taken up a lot by many of our meditation leaders so it's in demand. So there are many programs that we've got and we're building out more. We've also got a huge amount of teaching and this is in particular of significance right now to transition your meditation business to an online environment or for those that you are starting to allow you to start online and then move to uh, in-person classes. Uh, but some people are finding so much success online that they're planning to keep their online meditation classes going even after the lockdown has finished. Uh, one of the things that we do offer our leaders is a combined calendar. So we have literally hundreds of people looking for men meditation classes coming to this calendar every week. And if your meditation class is up there with all the other leaders, then you will get people coming to your online classes so that you can grow your community that way. We have lots of other stuff like five minute yoga stretches you can do at the beginning of your practice. We even create a web page for you and do marketing on your behalf. 
so that all the people coming through the Skillful Mind website will see your personal meditation class page and contact you if they're close to you or in a suitable time zone to meet your classes, as well as in-depth guides to how you can market your class on Facebook, Google, LinkedIn, Gumtree, Craigslist, and whatever other areas and whichever other avenues that leaders are finding useful at this time. This resource package is perfect for those people, as I said, in the health and wellness area, just like Bronwyn here, who receives a lot of support from us and she says there is no other place that has this much support without putting too much effort in, has a professional lesson plan ready to go for her for that week's meditation lesson. This course, like the other one, we sell separately to those people who are wanting all of those assets to make it easier for them to run their meditation classes for $970. The next package is our growth package, and this is really framed for people that don't wanna do it so much as a side business anymore, but one done for you proposals, complete end to end workshops that you can run in schools, that you can run in retirement homes, that you can run in corporates to be able to transition to a full time meditation business. We have a unique run your own retreat mentoring program where not only do we do all the work for you, but I personally sit down with you once a week or however many much time you need to plan out and create your retreat based on our already done for you templates so that you can have a successful two day, seven day or 10 day meditation retreat in your area of the world. But we can also help you create proposals for schools and run programs in schools. We've got testimonials from schools that have already used our programs and love what we do to help you get that added authority to do it in a school near you. Likewise, we've done workshops for companies and we have testimonials and proposals to help you create workshops in companies that are now crying out for meditation to be part of their health and wellness programs. And it is accelerating. We can help you get into retirements and hospitals just like Matthew that we showed you earlier in the presentation. And we can even help you do workshops on behalf of Skillful Mind to help you attract more meditation leaders, which is what we want to do so that we can make a better world. Like Patricia, who is looking at starting not only community groups, but moving into areas such as schools in London, in the UK, who loves the support that we give her to enable to her to do this quicker and more professionally than she could do by herself. This package is sold separately like the others if you are interested in doing that part of the session. Of course, you would need to have the credentials as a meditation teacher in order for you to do this. So as you can imagine, all together, the total value is 2910. But I wanna make this totally achievable for you. So as a special, all of this program today, we're going to do it for just a special price of just $970. That's right. You effectively buy one module and you get all the modules for free. But listen, that's not everything because over the years we've analyzed what our top performing leaders are doing and how they get clients to make a sustainable income. And like I said, my priority is to see that you're doing what you love and that you can sustain it with an income to match. So I want to talk about a couple of other extra things that we want to do to make sure that you're up and running quickly and profitably so that you can sustain it for the long term. The first thing we've got is a 21 day certification and start challenge. Now I know some people will work faster, some people will work slower, but this is a good goal to aim for and we will support you to try and make sure it happens within 21 days. As well, we want to give you a seven day kickstart program, which I have developed myself, taking all the key aspects that our leaders have used to get them started quickly to get their first 10 students and to get some cash flow coming in the door. So this program is one thing that you can do each day for seven days that will guarantee you if you do everything every day, it will guarantee you at least six or seven, maybe up to 10 students a day and a cash flow of $1,000. Wouldn't that be great? So just imagine running your first class in as little as 21 days. The total value of this is 294, but we're going to include it free in the $970 package. So imagine getting your class going and being paid $1,000 to start. That will give you the momentum for you to start spreading your passion throughout the world. 
That's it, a total value of $3,204 with everything you need to get started within 21 days. But listen, I told you a little fib earlier, I told you I was gonna give you a way to make $1,000. Well, I wanna make sure this works absolutely 100% success for you. So I'm actually gonna tell you another way you can help generate cash flow. And that is to further ensure your success, we wanna give you access to our Skillful Mind Affiliate Accelerator program that allows you to take a commission of everything that we sell here at Skillful Mind. I see it as instead of me paying Google and paying Facebook thousands of dollars every month, you are my people. You are the ones that are passionate about meditation and I would much rather give that money to you rather than these big companies. So with this affiliate program, you can create an unlimited residual income and it works by us giving you 40% so that you can create literally $1,000 a month residual income, which would give you a sustainable business to be able to go on and just concentrate on delivering your message. And finally, I just have one last thing to offer you. And actually, believe it or not, I think this is the most valuable part of our whole offering today. It is an unrivaled community support. So we now have, as I said, over 300 and growing leaders around the world, meditation experts, people who have been running classes, and they are such a friendly bunch. We get together monthly to chat about what's working and what's not working. We help each other in our meditation classes. We've got dedicated leader support. We've got a private community group on Facebook. We do Zoom meetings together. We get in industry experts. We have access to those to help us. And you get all of this access to this ongoing mastermind group. So there is nothing else to pay. You have lifetime access to all of these great people. Now, $1,200 really is a conservative estimate on access to people like this, but we're going to include it in this program free of charge. That is a total of $4,404 altogether. But as I said, everything today we're going to give you for just $970 but it's for those people who take action, who really have that passion and want to start. So everything you need in a single box to create a successful meditation business. That's the three packages, learning certification, all the resources vault with all your lesson plans and marketing planned out for you, and also proposals and help to run your own retreats or deliver corporate workshops, a special 21 day package, which includes a seven day kickstart package to get your first group up and running and get your cash flow positive and access to the most amazing group on earth of dedicated, passionate leaders in meditation, as well as our affiliate program. But listen, I don't want to actually sell you this package here today. Instead, I want to give you an opportunity to experience our teachings firsthand. So my request of you today is to simply purchase the very start of this program for the price of a cup of coffee per week. Yes, that's right. Imagine just paying $4.50 and again, we have a complete money back guarantee per week for three months just to access all the learning of meditation to get a taste of what we can deliver at Skillful Mind. Now, if you value your mind at all, $4.50 a week is nothing to pay for learning how to meditate properly. And even if you just be, are able to take your meditation level to a deeper level, let's say stage four or five on the uh, nine stages of the meditation journey, then it would be worth far more than the few dollars you pay today. But if you wanna then be inspired to go out and teach your community, of course, we'll be in touch to see if you wanna take the rest of the package. But for the time being, click on the button below and for just a few dollars a week, you can start learning to take your mind to a deeper level of meditation and get to know our family a little bit better here at Skillful Mind. Just imagine yourself 21 days from now, sitting with a beautiful bunch of people, practicing what you love, being amongst like-minded people, generating peace and harmony in your community, or perhaps going on retreat with equally lovely people, inspiring them from your life and your passion. Groups can be as large as 20 or 30, or as small as four or five, it's really up to you. 
this is where your future lies. I've transitioned from being an engineer to doing this full time and I can guarantee you it is the most rewarding change in my life that I've ever made and I want that for you and I'm here to support you to do just that. Again, please don't procrastinate. This price will go up. We will be putting it up. You have nothing to lose with the 30 day guarantee and everything to gain. I hope to see you on the other side. Thank you for attending this webinar and I look forward to chatting to you about your plans in the near future. Peter Radcliffe signing out. Namaste, thank you very much. I was about to cancel, call it and cancel, the, but then a part of me said, your mind is making excuses. Um, I think every day I learned something new. So yeah, it was fantastic. Well, to be quite honest, I, I didn't have any expectations other than I knew it would be good for me body, soul and heart. If there's a particular issue, people want to try and work on something that's blocking them, an obstacle they've got in their life, I think this is really powerful. I describe it best like my life is looks like a snow globe. Just shook it all up and then put it back on the shelf and everything was settling and I was sort of, I panicked at the time, oh, is it all going back in the right place? What I've found is that it's a really well engineered program and the material that he offers is extremely difficult to grasp and he explains it in a way and gives examples in, in everyday life that really helps us to understand uh, what that particular message is. He's a really good teacher. There's a breadth of content. What you cover in a really short space of time um, and the way that you do that really with a good balance of head and heart um, there's, there is, as I said, an elegant simplicity in the way that you've put the program together and it's actually really powerful. My witnessing of myself is deepening and I'm opening to what I would say would be a truer me. And as the course went on, everything settled in exactly the right place and I felt empowered to be something that I never was before. Um, and it's exceeded the expectations because all the deep work that uh, Peter's done with us has brought out some really significant things about my life that I probably hadn't even considered before. What I've taken from this is that whatever excuse you make is actually an excuse you make. It's not an excuse out there. So you should be able to do it every single day without hesitation because the impact and benefits that you derive from this are immeasurable. I would suggest anyone to be a part of this program either as part of the community or as a leader because it's just been phenomenal. Within someone, even if they don't know why they feel some kind of connection, this is something they want to do, then it's worth, you know, connecting with that and pursuing that. It's been absolutely amazing.